This ceiling project has been the most annoying project I think I've worked on so far. The ceiling used to look like this, so I feel like it is looking better, which is good. Not all of my work has gone to waste, but if I had known how annoying these ceiling tiles would be, I think I would have gone a different direction. I like their durability, but these corners, see how they kind of bend out? I don't like that because you have to overlap each tile on top of each other. So these corners where they're already bending out create these nice little obvious lines and it's really hard to get them to lay flat. So I've been trying all sorts of different techniques. I've used duct tape. Uh, I think this corner, I used duct tape to try and hide the lines. Uh, I used caulk here, which I don't think did much. I've used drywall compound to try and even out the lines. I've sanded that out. I've even tried just cutting the corners off so that there's not so many layers overlapping each other. So I'm really over trying to do patchwork. I've caulked uh, the, what do you call it? Ugh. I've caulked the crown molding. I put that up uh, the other day. I think I'm just gonna go ahead and put a coat of paint on, see how it looks. Oh, this was so aggravating, mainly because I think there was just a lot of little detail work that I wasn't anticipating. And this is the smallest section that I have going on for this PVC tile. Up in the loft, I'm doing the same thing and there's a lot more square footage up here. So am I regretting my decisions? Yes. You little turd. <laughs> the only time you want on my stepladder is when I'm using it. Uh-huh, don't you look away from me. I'm talking to you. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me, I'm saying excuse me. Excuse me. Thank you. I think it's gonna look all right. I debated whether or not to paint the ceiling green. I thought maybe I would do like this copper color, but I have a brass light fixture and I would rather have the light fixture pop against the green rather than have it disappear with the copper. I think it's gonna look okay. The only problem is my neck is killing me. I should have painted these darn things before I hung them. Next time. Okay, first coat done. Whew. Looking good. Time for a second coat. Alrighty. The second coat is done. The ceiling is, well, mostly finished. After the second coat, I'm really liking how it turned out. I switched out the light bulbs in this light because the ones before it were way too bright. So this is a lot more ambient, ambiance, um, ambient. Do you guys even remember what the entryway looked like when we bought it? I'm having a hard time believing that this is the same space. Also, since I like you guys, I'm gonna show you something that's actually not quite finished. Well, okay, not the ceiling upstairs. Don't look at that. This trim, this piece of trim, I need to replace to bring out to where this panel ends. I had to cut it short there because otherwise I would have had to cut it on that ridge 
long ways. I don't think it would have looked very good. So I'm gonna eventually replace this trim piece running along here with a wider one. Um, I also still wanna style this, like I'm looking for an entryway table here. Eventually I'd like to get maybe some wall hooks for people to hang their coats when they walk in. We will eventually have a coat closet. This is the coat closet. It's currently Tango's litter box because that room back there needs to be finished. That's eventually where his litter box is gonna go, in that mud room. Overall, I think I'd give these tiles like a seven out of 10. They look really good but putting them up was like the worst thing in the world. I will link them down below if you're interested. If you're like a super picky about how the details look, I wouldn't recommend them because you're gonna be fighting a lot trying to hide the creases where the tiles line up with each other. I'm just hoping whenever people come over and they're not gonna be inspecting my ceiling. Also putting them up on the ceiling is really hard work because your neck is just like, cranked back so far and your arms are working above your head the whole time. So it was difficult in that aspect too. Next time I think I would paint the tiles before I put them up. Overall, I'm loving how the entryway is turning out. I'm excited to put my finishing touches on it, make it a little bit more homey. We'll see you next time. <laughs>